Good morning. I'm Mike Neundorfer with Advanced RV. This is Kyle Thomas. And Kyle's been working with Advanced RV for about six months, Kyle? It's almost a year now. Has it been that long? <laughs> yeah, it's okay. been that long. Kyle's been with Advanced RV for almost a year. He's the inventor of the Grow Guard. Uh, he lives in uh, Seattle, so he can be close to the mountains. And uh, he has a Sprinter 144, which he uses to test a lot of the things that we do together and some other things. So I wanted to just talk about testing the grow guard. Uh, yeah. You had an experience recently where you uh, took it through a river, right? Yeah. And we've been doing rigorous testing on it since we started uh, developing the product, but just recently we took a trip where the road got totally washed out and uh, we still wanted to get to our destination, so we figured it'd be a good chance to put some products to test. And uh, I wish I could say that uh, the grill guard made it through perfectly, but upon the, uh, exiting the river, we smashed up the front of the vehicle and uh, had some damage. But I can tell you that uh, the vehicle itself had literally no damage to it, and the grill guard did exactly what it was supposed to, and it took all the, all the grunt of the work. So great. it was great to see. So you went through a river. Uh, I assume you got up enough of a head of, head of steam so that you could come out the other side. <laughs> and was there any damage to the vehicle? There was just none. There was none. none. It didn't even touch the skin of the bumper. So it uh, bent the skid plate a little bit. But luckily, the skid plates come off. And all I have to do is unbolt my skid plate and put on a new one now. Great. So, so. when you came out of the river, uh, your, the, the bank was a little high. And you, you skidded along and the... And the Grill guard actually bounced the uh, the front end of the right. All the the whole weight of the vehicle was put on the grill guard, and it started to lift the front a little bit up. But luckily, we had enough speed and just glided right over it. But you know, all that pressure on that grill guard. Oh, uh, that's great. Yeah, you know that your design is amazing because it's so robust, and there are two bars that are structurally joined with heavy plate. Is it quarter inch? A quarter, quarter inch steel in the, for the winch receiver, uh, and then it's all aluminum construction for the whole grill guard. So, so it's, it's super lightweight too. It's light, but it and and, and it's it uh, bolts onto the structure, the main frame structure of the Sprinter. Four points of contact directly into the frame, and no drilling holes. It looks cool because of the bolt-on uh, parts, but that allows you to replace parts if, if you have damage. But it's not only cool looking; it is robust. Right. And and that's what people are liking. That's why we've sold the ones we've sold to people right. that can really see that it's not just decoration. It's totally. for the guys that really want to be able to go off grid, yeah. want to be able to have a removable winch that mounts both in the front and the back, yep. and uh, and a grill guard that'll take you through the creek uh, without damaging the the the, uh, <laughs> the, the whole front of your van. Yeah. Right. We really wanted the best of both worlds. We realized you could just do a full replacement front bumper out of steel or aluminum plate, but you know, with the front of the Mercedes Benz, the way it has a pretty elegant design to it, the way it sits, and we don't want to hide what Mercedes Benz has done. We want to call attention to the details that they have. So that's why we went with uh, the smaller package, but as you can see, that's just what you need. You just need a little bit off the front of the vehicle, and it's just a uh, an elegant solution to complement what Mercedes has already done. Well, that's great. Uh, on another note, Kyle, I am thrilled to have you as part of our team. Thank the you. more we work together, the more I, I see your talents, and I'm pleased to be working with you. That's really nice, Mike. I appreciate that. Thanks, Kyle. That's sweet.